A lively downtown as St. Patrick's Day, the start of the NCAA basketball tournament fall on the same weekend, making it a dual holiday for lots of Indianapolis basketball fans. Fox 59's Russ McQuay joins us from the Bottle Works District, where both holidays will be celebrated this weekend. Russ? And good afternoon. Well, we're inside right now because it's kind of wet and cold outside here in the Bottle Works District, but when the storm clouds blow over overnight, all day tomorrow, downtown will be filled with both basketball and Irish fans. Can I get a little drum roll, please? Only part of the canal was green today because the fountain off Ohio Street wasn't working. So, firefighters did their best to spray non-toxic dye to bring out the Irish to a corner of the downtown waterway. O'Reilly's Irish Pub expects to be full by this time tomorrow with bagpipes wailing and serving up bangers and mash. Here in the Bottle Works District, basketball fans will be able to watch the games on dual big screens like West Virginia fans Ben Belt and Lauren Upchurch. It's just been on the bucket list for a long time since they started and this is really the first year that it worked out. So here we are. And I took the day off work to do this. So. And coming up at 5.30, we'll tell you why both basketball fans and celebration planners expect a lot of people will begin calling in sick, calling their bosses tomorrow morning. Live in the Bottle Works District, Russ McQuaid, Fox 59 News. Rush has ruined my plan there. Thank you, Russ. Well,